Hi all, my name's Lacey Pitcher. I am a Roman registered locum nurse um, and founder of Veterinary Pay It Forward. I just wanted to pass on my sincere thanks um, to everyone man in the front line currently. That's your vets, nurses, receptionists, every member of the team, our cleaners, everyone that makes this possible. And my thoughts to those who are furloughed, it's really difficult at times like this when we're all separated from our veterinary family. Um, but we are all very much together and it's been awe inspiring to see how as a veterinary community everyone has come together to support each other and play their part. Keep fighting, we are all with you and just know that you are making a difference to so many people and so many patients throughout the UK while this pandemic affects every aspect of life. You are very much thought of and appreciated. Hi, my name's Lee Northway and I'm a registered veterinary nurse. I work at Wendover Heights Veterinary Centre in Buckinghamshire. I just wanted to say a massive thank you to my colleagues and our veterinary profession as a whole. At the moment, the teams are working extremely hard to look after our patients um, that need us. Those of us that are furloughed, that are at home, are thinking of you all and wish we were there to lend our support um, in practice. Um, at times of upset, we always come together as a profession, and we are right now, um, but please always speak to us if you need help and support. We are going to come out the other side of this, um, so hang on in there, you're doing amazing, um, and we're really, really grateful for your hard work. Hey, my name is Hannah Capon. I work at Greenside Vet Clinic in Scotland and I run Canine Arthritis Management. Massive shout out to the vet profession. How proud am I to be part of this industry? Aren't we doing amazing? To all the vets and nurses and veterinary assistants and receptionists that are still out there working on the front line, you know, high five. And to all the people that are at home working away, getting ready for when we can get back to work and serve these little critters. How little do they know? Thank you, guys. I think you're awesome. Hold in there. We'll get through this. Bye. Hi everyone, my name's Katie. I'm a small animal veterinary surgeon working in the Greater Manchester area as well as a veterinary coach. I just want to take this opportunity to say a huge, huge thank you to everyone working on the front line providing emergency services. We're so proud of you all. I know it's going to be hard work, but the vet profession is strong. You guys are a brilliant asset and I can't wait for the day when we're all back together working as one big team again. Hi, my name is Emily. I'm a veterinary nurse and veterinary physiotherapist. I just want to do a big shout out to the NHS staff and key workers out there that are going above and beyond their job roles to make sure that we all stay safe. I particularly want to shout out to all the veterinary staff. The veterinary industry has had to adapt massively over the last few weeks to make sure that they're supporting all the animals out there because we all know how much we love and care for our animals and if anything kind of were to happen to them it's nice to know that we still have a great team of veterinary staff there to, to kind of help and protect us. The veterinary industry has had to adapt massively over the last few weeks to make sure that they're supporting the animal industry but also helping to support the human industry whether it's donating ventilators, uh, PPE or even just volunteering kind of around extra shifts. So I'm so grateful for all the wonderful veterinary colleagues that I have in the industry and the amount of work that they're going uh, going for it. Um, hopefully this won't be for too much longer, but if we all just stay safe and stay home, hopefully we'll protect all our key workers and NHS staff. So thank you everyone for doing all the best that you're doing. Hello. I'm Carrie, I'm a pet bereavement counsellor and a tutor for InnoVet CPD training and I just wanted to give an absolutely massive, massive thank you to all the veterinary staff that are working on the front line looking after all the nation's pets. Even though your patients aren't human doesn't make your job any less important and you're out there risking yourselves to look after all the pets of families that are staying at home for longer noticing more issues and you know there may be more people coming in with their pets but you're there for them as you have always been and I just want to say thank you so much for everything that you're doing the hard work you always put in and you may not feel appreciated but you are okay we see you we hear you and we appreciate everything that you do so thank you all so so much for everything you're doing keep up the great work take care stay safe
Hello, my name is Carla Finsel and I'm a registered veterinary nurse. I am in the front line providing emergency care to animals and looking after my colleagues and members of the public at this time of coronavirus crisis. Keep safe and much love to all our colleagues that are sent home at this time. We love you. We miss you. We know you want to be with us. Look after yourselves. Hey everyone, I'm Kim, a registered vet nurse from the Midlands. I uh, just want to say a massive shout out to everybody in the veterinary profession right now. You're all working really, really hard and you should be really, really proud of yourselves. Uh, yes, times are tough right now and we're probably all um, in difficult situations, challenging situations, but honestly, you should be really, really proud. Keep up the good work and stay safe. Hi everybody, my name's Claire Blore. Um I'm Head of Veterinary Nursing Farrier at Myersco College. Um, I just wanted to take this opportunity to say a massive thank you um, to a whole range of people uh, in this very bizarre situation we find ourselves in due to COVID-19. Um, firstly, I'd like to say a massive thank you to my team at Myersco College. You're all doing extraordinary work to help continue support uh, our students and practices um, and for that you know you know I'm extremely grateful uh, for everything that you're doing and similarly to to other educators uh, across the country um, it's certainly been a challenge <laughs> trying to move everything uh, online for our, for our students to maintain that support um, but you're all doing a fantastic job um, to the students you will get there I promise I promise the whatever the next step is uh, in in your education, whether that's progressing to the next year, um, whether it's achieving your your advanced diploma or your BSc or your initial license to practice qualification, um, and you, you're on that brink of getting your red red badge, um, it, it will happen. It will happen. Um, just hang in there. Just hang in there. This this will be over at some point um and you will you will join that register um and the main thanks really goes to to all of the practices um out there who are still open um and doing their utmost to support their clients which ultimately um helps to to maintain the health and, and welfare of all of the animals that are, that are committed to our our care um, which is of vital importance during during these these times. Um, so yeah, to all the receptionists, the the cleaners, auxiliary nurses, A and A's, VCAs, student vet nurses, um, RVNs, and and veterinary surgeons. To all of you who are out there on the front line in veterinary practice, keeping things going, um, you're amazing. Absolutely amazing. Um, and the work you're doing just shows the resilience and dedication of, of this profession to animal health and welfare. Um, so, yeah, I just wanted to say thank you um, and good luck to you all. Stay safe. Look after each other at a distance, of course. Um, and I'll see you on the other side. Hi, guys, my name's Catherine and I'm a locum vet working in Greater Manchester. I just wanted to take this opportunity to say a massive thank you to everybody in all areas of the veterinary community for everything you're doing right now to keep our pets and our animals safe. Thank you too to their families who are providing a massive amount of support at a really, really difficult time. This is not an ideal time for anybody, so we are really, really grateful for everything that you're doing. Remember, we're here to support each other, so be kind, stay safe, Stay home when you can, and we can all get through this together. Hi guys, I'm Emma Davis. I'm a veterinarian from Australia. I just wanted to reach out and say thank you so much to all the vets and nurses and support staff who are working and serving the community on the front line. Thank you so much. It's really appreciated what you're doing. We know it's not easy to be away from your family at this time. Um, it's difficult for all of us and we appreciate that you're representing our profession, keeping the community safe, looking after the animals and upholding animal welfare. 
Um, just stay safe yourselves and reach out for help when you need it. We, we've got your back. Um, if you need help, reach out and we can support you and we will all get through this together. Hi guys, my name is Emily and I'm a small animal veterinary nurse from Worcestershire. Um, I just wanted to say thank you to all of you guys that are working really hard. Um, I know it's difficult in these current times, but I honestly really appreciate the hard work that you guys are putting in. Um, for those of you who have been furloughed, I am so sorry that this has happened. I think it's just a unfortunate term in the circumstances. Um, but we will get through this, um, we will get get through it together. Um, I, myself, as the creative Sherlock the Vet Nurse, really try to bring some positivity um, and just try to bring a sense of normality to everybody, you know. Everybody's in, you know, isolation, not being able to see family and friends. Uh, I know we've got technology, but it's just not quite the same. So just being able to have that um, form of normality to our lives I think is really important. So, um, yeah, like I said, I'm so grateful for you all. Um, I hope that you're all safe um, and that you're doing okay. You can always reach out if you need to. Um, but, yeah, thank you so much, guys. Like, the gratitude that I feel for you all is unreal. Thanks, guys. Hi, I'm Rachel from Cotswold Animal Therapy and I'm one of the speakers for Innovet CPD. Um, Noodle and I would just like to say um, a big thumbs up and a well done to all the veterinary staff out there that are carrying on in really difficult circumstances. Keep going, you're doing an amazing job and hopefully this will all be over soon and we can all go back to normal. But in the meantime, well done and keep going. Hi, I'm Vicky, I run Innovet CPD. I just wanted to say a huge thank you to everybody for what you're doing right now. We're, we're all missing each other and hopefully in a few short months we'll all be back to some degree of normality and I just want to say a huge thank you as well to everybody that got involved in putting this video together. We, we hope that this brightens your day and we'll see you all the other side. Thank you. Hi, my name is Victoria Bowes and I work at the Warwickshire College Veterinary Nursing Department. This is a big shout out to all the vets and the veterinary nurses and any of the veterinary staff that are working through this very, very hard time at the moment. Uh, we are thanking our public sector workers full stop all the time um, and you should be recognised for the work that you do. You are a industry that holds my heart and will hold it forever. So I just want to say thank you from me to you and to any of you that are working during this time. Keep yourself safe, be safe and also, you know, keep going. You're strong enough, we're all strong enough, we can get through this together. Good on guys, you're amazing. Hi everyone, my name is Chloe Little and I'm an RVN from Essex working at the Wiley Veterinary Centre in Upminster which is a small animal hospital. Whether you're still in practice, on isolation, on sick leave, um, caring for a vulnerable person in your family or currently on furlough, I just wanted to say thank you and you're all still doing an amazing job. I know isolation can be a bit of a lonely place, especially if you're not living with family um, but we all are going to get through this in the next few weeks, maybe months, but it will get better. Take care everyone and stay safe. Lots of love. Hello, my name is Naomi Goff. I work at Danbury Veterinary Clinic in Dorset. Um, just a short message, just to say thank you to all of the veterinary professionals working so hard at this extremely stressful and ever-changing time. We are resilient as a profession and we will get through this together. Thank you everyone. Hi, my name is Arlen Stone and I'm a member of the Lumbry Park Veterinary Specialist Team. I just want to say a massive thank you to all the veterinary professionals who are out there maintaining the health and well-being of all of our pets. I feel so proud to be part of this professional and educated community. Just want to say thank you, well done and stay safe. My name's Nikki, I'm a registered veterinary nurse in Scotland. Um, I have been furloughed from my job but I still do have to go and do some pet blood bank sessions as a phlebotomist. So I just want to send support to other team members and other vets and nurses who are in the profession still holding us all together. It's amazing what you're doing and we thank you for it very much. Thank you. 
Hi everyone, my name's Claire Burrows. I'm a veterinary nurse working at Lancaster Vets. I want to show my support and gratitude to all the veterinary staff who will continue to provide excellent service to all our patients and their owners during these really difficult times. There's so much changed in such a short space of time for us as a profession and yet everybody has just adapted amazingly well. I also want to show support to any of those staff that are self-isolating or furloughed at the moment. Being in this position myself, I know it's really difficult um, not being able to support your teams uh, in what is a really challenging situation, but we have to do everything we can to look after everybody and keep everybody safe. Thank you so much to everybody for all your amazing work. Keep safe and keep doing what you're doing.